Okay, so today we're going to be showing you how to solder with a turbo torch. Turbo torch is a little tricky because it tends to put out a lot of heat. So what we're going to do is you can control the heat by adjusting the regulator, or we can control the heat also by adjusting the knob. So I'm going to lower the heat, uh, but it's not good for the tip. The best thing is to run it full steam, going all out, because uh, the heat comes back on the tip and tends to overheat the tip. So we could do it for a little bit, but not for a long period of time. So we're going to go ahead and set up our joint for soldering. I've already sanded it and cleaned it. Okay. We're going to go ahead and just put the flux on, a regular soldering paste really. Put it down to about an eighth of an inch, right about to the end. Give it a little twist, insert it. Alright, and then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn on my torch, quarter turn, open up my valve, ignite it. I'm going to watch the flux. Now remember I said we're going to control the heat, so that's normally what you have at. You're going to bring it down to it just a little bit. Right there. Actually, a little bit less than that, right? I could use that flame. Might not be hot enough, but we'll watch, watch the pipe. Just might carburize the pipe. So we're looking for some smoke to come up on the back. Once I see the smoke, put the solder on the front. Let's bring the heat up a little bit more. Right there. And then we'll put the solder on the back, and it'll come around the front. And that's it. Normally we'd let it cool down naturally. Used a little much when I adjusted the flame, but that's pretty much it. You can adjust the flame as you need to to solder with the pipe. So we'll cool that down. And that's soldering with the turbo torch.